Hi everyone, welcome along. I now want to show you a short video on how you can set up some of the parameters within the boiler. To set the parameters of the boiler we need to access the service menu. I have done another video on this on accessing the service menu on our YouTube installers channel. Okay, so if we now go to the boiler I'll show you exactly how we can get into the parameters. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is access the service menu. So to access the service menu, we press and hold the menu and OK button together for 4 seconds. Once we're in the service menu, we scroll to B2 and this is system configuration. Again, please refer to the manufacturing instructions for a full list of what all these codes are. There are tables in the manufacturing instructions. If you haven't got a copy of the manufacturing instructions, you can find this on VBooks online. Okay, so I'm not going to show you every single parameter as we go through the video. I'd just like to show you a few, highlight a few as I go through. The first one I'm going to show you is number three. Number three is our scald protection. So we can turn scald protection on and off. What this does, this sets the boiler so it doesn't uh, go above 60 degrees on our hot water. Okay, as you can see here, it's on. If we want to turn it off, we can press the down button, not forgetting to press OK to store that information. Okay, and if we want to change it again, we go back down to number three, press OK and then turn it back on. Press OK and that stores the information. As you can see, it automatically goes to the next parameter. Okay, what I'd like to show you next is setting the boiler to its minimum and maximum output. If we look in the charts, that's numbers six and seven. So six is our minimum output. And you can see there the number seven and that's 7%. So that's 7% of its maximum output. So we do need to know what the maximum output of this boiler is. This is a 35 kilowatt combi, so the maximum heating output is 32 kilowatts. So if we go back and go to, C, uh, go to number 7, press OK, this is now setting our maximum output. So at 100% it would give us 32 kilowatts of heating, and just for easy maths, if I needed 16 kilowatts of heating, I'd hold the down arrow till I get to 50%, and that would then give us 16 kilowatts of heating maximum. So press OK, that's now stored into the boiler. Number eight is setting our maximum flow temperature. So we can set a maximum flow temperature on the boiler. We can see here it's set to 82 degrees. Say for example this is in a property where there's vulnerable people in the property and we can't have a flow temperature higher than 60 degrees for example. We could reduce this down and then the boiler would never go above 60 degrees. So we press OK and that stores that information in. To get back out of the menu, we press the menu button once, that goes back to the service menu, press it again and that's back to the main screen.